Good morning, afternoon, night, morning, right? I'm going to be doing this. I saw you. I'm going to tea with my mom. She's going to be eating out. My sister had court. I can tell you just it got extended um, until December 10th. That's all I'm going to say. Um, don't want to live a crazy journey I call life. It is three days till I leave September 10th at the moment. So, yeah, I can tell you guys this much. Me and my mom are not getting along. I'll explain that here in a little bit. Good morning, afternoon, night, whenever it is that this video decides to find you. Sad to say this, but it is 9 11. We're not even gonna go, we're not even gonna talk about that topic. But I'm on my way to my dad's. Um, I normally go over there to listen to music, raid his fridge, um, and just talk to Lord, to the Lord, and everything. I brought my notebook and everything because I'm also gonna journal a little bit. Um, I want to talk to you guys a little bit about what happened yesterday. Amanda lost her kids. That's all I'm going to say. Um, until she can get her shit together. That's literally all I'm going to say on that topic. Um, yeah, if you guys can't tell, my freckles and my eyes like to really pop in the sun. But, good morning, afternoon, night, whatever it is that this video decides to find you. Two days till I leave. Come along with me. That's crazy journey I call life. And yeah, I'm gonna listen to some more music like I was doing prior to deciding to up and record, so. Hey you guys, so currently over at my dad's, I was listening to some music, um, also video chatting my friend that is going to be taking me um, Tennessee, um, just to figure out the plan and everything. Him and I don't talk all the time. I'm still very, uh, with Caleb. Um, this friend is just taking me to Tennessee to, uh, take me there to do some mental health, uh, take me to the mental health facility, that way I can work on my well-being, so that way I can be a better mom and better wife to Caleb, um, now I'm pretty sure all the comments are going to say that, like, why don't you get treatment in Nebraska, I wanted to bring this to everyone's attention now, I very well could, um, get some help in Nebraska, but here's the thing, I don't want to, Nebraska has really fucked me over in so many different ways, um, and at this point, I'm just kind of fed up with it, I'm fed up with Nebraska, I'm fed up with fucking Ogallala, and all the drama that's just in this fucking town, with my sister and everything, and that drama, it... Makes me not proud to be a Nebraskan girl anymore, and I've been a Nebraskan girl my entire fucking life. So, it's sad that one certain fucking person can turn your life completely fucking upside down. Now, I haven't made a podcast video about this person, and you guys know her, my sister, she's very well known in this fucking town. She is something else. Sorry, I'm currently refilling the salt. Um, I'll make a podcast video about her, maybe. I don't know. I want to make a podcast video on so many, like, so many of the, like, I want to make a podcast video about all the bullshit and everything. Hang on, I can't do this one handed. And by the way, proves that I did refill the salt. I wasn't lying. Um, about so many things, calling out certain people and stuff like that. And I don't want that to be my podcast, but sometimes that's what I have to do to get my point across. I mean, I've done it before to certain classmates and everything, and they do see my videos, but, and that did cause problems for me. And I learned my lesson on that. But when it comes to family, it's different. And I'm currently watching wrestling because I've missed the past few fucking 
previous or uh yeah um main like big events all i know is that the drama here is ridiculous the drama surrounding everyone living here is ridiculous the drama that somehow still manages to fuck up my life is ridiculous it just pisses me off like no doubt it really does piss me off so that is why I'm going out of state, out of town, to get the mental help that I need. Sorry, the charger keeps fighting me. Now, I'm just going to tell you guys this. My kids will be fine. They're with their dad and their grandparents and everything like that. My kids will be fine. And of course, if I can have my phone, I'm going to keep in contact with him. Caleb and I fight and argue, yes. But that's what every relationship is and that's what every relationship does. Does that necessarily mean him and I are going to get, like, divorced and everything? No. Because I am trying to better myself. I've been going to church. I have been reading self-help books. I've been doing absolutely everything in my power to make sure I'm the best mom and best wife for him and our kids. Like, I love my family that I have created. And I just want to get better, clear my head, have a better mindset for my children. That is all I'm doing, okay? And the people that are putting me down and stuff because of this, Keep in mind, I'm 21, okay? I'm an adult, and I will do whatever I need to do and whatever I have to do and whatever I want to do for my family. If you don't like it, stop talking to me. It is that simple, okay? That simple. With that being said, like, the podcast video where I said I am leaving and everything is not a goodbye. It's just, like, this is what's happening, my recent, like, life update. Like, that is all it is. Like, I don't understand why it's such a big deal that I'm trying to better myself for my family. Like, why is that such a bad thing? Like, for real, I don't get it. I, I don't get it at all. Please enlighten me. Actually, don't, because I could care the fuck less what wants to be up to fucking sleep. Because half the time, it's fucking negative. But it is currently lunchtime. My dad said that I can come over here, even though him and I are on the outs because of me leaving. Uh, if I ever needed some food, so that's exactly what the fuck I'm doing. I'm also going to make, uh, TikTok videos, um, just basically explaining what I'm explaining to you guys now on that platform. Um, that way you guys fully get my thing. I'm even gonna make a tick uh, Instagram live about it. Not gonna post much on Snapchat, um, about the situation. Mainly because I just don't want to. I mean, TikTok, YouTube, and Instagram are my main platforms. And Snapchat is honestly just a platform that I upload on every so often anyways. I mean, I've been even thinking about deleting the app um, because it's just a toxic environment. So, I don't know. But just get keep that in mind, okay, you guys? I don't want to make my like channel like this but y'all are in my family like y'all are not getting my whole point and i hope when i make these podcast episodes y'all finally understand